Thomas Hardy was in love when he wrote Far From the Matting Crowd. He'd been in love with Emma Gifford for three years or so, and married her soon after the book was published. Emma's father was a lawyer of sorts, the alcoholic sort, some said, and he thought Hardy was socially beneath him, referring to him as a low-born churl who presumed to marry into my family. Hardy's people worked with their hands. They were masons and bricklayers. For a long time, Hardy, encouraged by his mother, wanted to go off to Oxford or Cambridge and maybe become a clergyman. Unfortunately for English literature, that was not to be. Oxford and Cambridge in those days were not for the bricklaying classes. Instead, Hardy was apprenticed to study architecture. He was quite good at it. Good enough to earn a living when he left the rustic life of Dorset and went up to London. There he began writing. No one's ever explained the chemistry that makes gifted writers of people apparently destined for humdrum lives. But Hardy had the gift, and not just for fiction. He also produced first-rate poetry. Far From the Matting Crowd was his first popular success. It was set in the quiet beauty of Dorset, a county in the southwest of England on the Channel. Hardy used Dorset as a setting for many of his stories. In later books, its beauty becomes an ironic counterpoint to the dark events he creates on its landscapes. But darkness hasn't yet infected the man who's writing far from the madding crowd. He's still young and in love, and everything is going his way. For Mobile Masterpiece Theater, I'm Russell Baker. Good night. Next time... Oh, you must be heartless. ...on Mobile Masterpiece Theater. Does a woman keep her promise, Gabriel? She's young yet. An impulsive flirtation may have ominous consequences. You care for your reputation. Be more discreet towards this soldier. Don't let him comment on my sight. What difference does it make? Oh, sweetheart, she is. And she can't be yours. The conclusion of Far From the Madding Crowd. Far From the Madding Crowd is available on home video cassette for $29.95 plus shipping and handling. To order, call one 800 255-9424